Freedom, today I wanna to talk to you about the footage you may not use on a daily basis. So I'm not necessarily talking about your blooper footage. What I wanted to talk to you about is maybe something that you either shot or maybe a gameplay that you filmed and you decided later, eh, maybe I don't wanna post this. A great example from me recently and a great way for me to also update you on some of the things that I'm working on is recently I filmed this video um, which I decided not to post because I didn't think that it stood on its own well enough. Roll the clip. Freedom, today I wanted to ask your opinion on your preference between virtual versus real sets. The reason I'm asking this is because I believe I'm going to start working on a pilot for a show that utilizes a real set. Of course, for me, that means uh, that I'm gonna have to face some different editing challenges than what I'm used to, but I'm curious what you have to say on the matter. So, which do you like better, virtual or real? I don't know. I kind of feel like I'm split on the issue. Till next time, I'm Anthony. Like, subscribe, comments, please. Assume we'll probably leave it this way rather than every day um, re. Well, we do have two. Uh, can like you go ahead and shut the camera off? So as you can see, it's kind of a strange short video. And also, while I was experimenting with backgrounds, I also kind of filmed these. This is an early test of a pure white background. Look behind me. This is a test of a pure white background. This is a test of a pure white background. This is a test of a pure white background. Look behind me. Now, normally speaking, these are not things that I would have released or even shown off because they're testing footage and they just don't jive well. However, um, the reason that I wanted to share these with you is because there are occasions where you can put these together in short videos, almost like this one, and you can still utilize them. And a lot of times your fans, your followers, your whatever you call them, will enjoy being able to see maybe what they missed out on, maybe some interim steps. And it's also a great way for you to maybe foreshadow other things coming up. I'm not saying that that's what I'm doing with this video or anything. What I'd like to challenge you to do, even if it's on Unlisted or Private or on a second channel, I'd love to see the cool things that you have decided not to post over the years. You can edit it and do a small montage. You can uh, link just blooper videos down below. Whatever it is, I want to see what you've decided you don't want people to see. A lot of times it can be a great exercise just in showing either how far you've grown or whatever the case is. I, I don't know. Use your imaginations because that's, this is YouTube. That's what this is all about. It's about using your imaginations. And I don't wanna hear anybody say that this wouldn't fit their content because I can't really think of anyone whose content this wouldn't fit. Cause it's just fun. So have fun with us, have fun with your audience. And worst case scenario, if you really believe that it wouldn't fit your content, Unlisted is perfectly fine. Anyways, till next time, I'm Anthony. Like, subscribe, comments please. Because I do this, and if I wear shoes, it makes clopping noises. I sound like I'm like, galloping. <laughs>